Haven't you heard of uh, First Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Mm -hmm. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't talk that. I must end it today. I cannot continue to live this kind of life. I cannot continue to be pitied by both friends and foes. If reincarnation is real, when I come back to this world, I will live a better life. At least, God will have mercy upon me for this life that he has given me now. I'm tired of it. I must end it today. A real man will never take away his life, no matter what he's passing through. He will find a way to hold on to last. Nobody is without a challenge. Be a man. Go home. Confront your challenges. Anyone who takes away his or her life is a coward. Allow God, who created you, to call you home when the time is due. have changed. Do you know during our time, it was all about love. Money never involved in anything about love. But these days, hmm, love is for sale. The highest bid that goes home with it. Oh, mama, it's not good now. It is not good. Such practice should be discouraged. Why? Do you know that love um, cannot put food on the table? Do you know that? Mama, if a man likes, let him be the most richest man in the world. Without love, those couple cannot live in peace. It's a lie, my dear. Without money, there will be no peace in that family. Ah. Ah, what are you telling me? Mama, as far as I, because this is concerned, I will marry a man because I love him, not because of his money. Money, my money, dear, money, Nico, money. Ego. Nico, please, Ngozi. I don't want you to make the same mistake I made in Anya. I don't want you to, guys, don't do the same mistake I made. Because if you do, you will regret it too. This one you are talking about love, love, love. But Mama, you once told me how you and my late father, your husband, loved each other. What happened? Your late father and I, we are inseparable. Even when I knew he had health challenge, I went ahead and married him. <sighs> what an art of foolishness. Very stressful. Yeah, but next time we try and come early enough. This so we can clean do the Tap on the fast. Can't you see how the product fast? The other side is growing. Very growing fast. Yes, yeah, so. That is nature. Ah. Ah. We need this first one. Hey. What is it? I'm weak. Did you take your medication this morning? No. It escaped my memory. Oh, yeah, it's wrong now. Please don't make this mistake again, no. Yeah. 
I will not. I will not. Hey, my husband! My husband! My husband! Wait, please wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Don't do this to me! The whole world will laugh at me! Please don't do this to me, my husband! Please! Somebody help me! My husband, please wake up! Wake up! My husband, please! Somebody help me! 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 I knew my husband was suffering from sickle cell disease. But because of that poor little word, I married him. Now, see where the love have landed me. But, Mama, you told me time without number that my late father was killed with charm by one of his king's men. Huh? I don't know what you're talking about. Please go and get me my phone. If not that four useless letter words called love, I wouldn't have married John. After all, Animuedo was richer than him. Now see me sin love. My daughter will never be a victim of love. Whosoever that will marry my daughter must be rich. Hello, my beautiful angel, my sweet tomatoes. <laughs> well, I just um, finished checking stocks at the warehouse and um, I think I'm kind of famished. I want to come pick you up at the office so we can go for lunch. I'm not in the office. Where are you? I'm at home. What happened? I have a mild headache. And you didn't bother to tell me. Chris, I'll be fine. Listen, I'm coming to pick you up so we can take you to the hospital. Send me your residential address now. Don't bother, I'll be fine. Thank you. Darling, you see, two years ago, my baby sister told us that she had a mild headache. We totally ignored her. Before we knew it, she was dead. Sarah died of a mild headache. Chris, for crying out loud, I'm not Sarah. And I'm not going to die. Are you wishing me dead? I know you are not Sarah, but I'm just... Bye. Hello? Thinking of taking your life on the assumption that the girl you love is about leaving you is foolishness. You're just living in fear of rejection. I have lost so much in this life as a result of my condition. She's the only good thing I have left. If she leaves me, how am I going to survive? I can't bear to live without her. Isn't it better that I just end it? No, no, no. Don't think that your condition is the worst. Nobody in this world is without a challenge. Go home and live your life. You know about Linus? You know him? Yes. Okay. I know Linus. Okay. He, he, he died in an accident. No, no. He went to bed healthy and in the morning he did not wake up. 
you are alive you're still breathing some are born and they died on the same day some will grow up get to five years they will die you are healthy you are alive go home and live your life What is happening? Welcome, mommy. Why are you crying? Mom, I'm not crying. I I just have a mild headache. So it's making me cry. Have you taken drugs? Not yet. But I feel I'm just stressed. If I rest a bit, I'll be fine. Um, yeah. Do take care of yourself, okay? Okay, mommy. I'll be downstairs. Fine. I have come to see you. I have very important matter to discuss with you. Okay. Um, can I come and see you later, please? I will not waste your time. Mommy, if I please, I'm not in the mood right now. Eh? I said I will not waste your time. I will come and see you, I promise. Eh. Eh. So I should go. Please. Now. Eh. Okay. No problem. Come on. Dad. Babe. My babe. 
What's up with you? Ah. Oh my god. You are crying. What's going on with you? Peggy, I got the worst embarrassment of my life today from Peter. How? I don't even know. I can't tell. I don't know why I deserve to be treated like this. I told you I don't like this. Why do you keep doing this? I, I, am I the first person in this world that was born in this condition? Why are you always doing this? Or am I the only man in the world that was born without a silver spoon? Have I ever asked you for money? Then what is the problem? Why are you always making me feel like there's, there's something wrong with me? You always... I, I don't like this. It's not like that. I... If you're going to come here and cry, oh, it's on. not like that. <laughs> Tell me what exactly did I do wrong? Why will he walk out on me without him? Without saying a word? Man, it's okay. Please stop crying. As far as I am concerned, you have never done anything wrong to him. I think he just wants you out of his life so he can marry another woman. Oh yes. Peggy. I love Peter. I love him. You still love him? I love him with all my heart. I Are love okay? him. A man that doesn't have a place in his heart for you. Oh, don't say no it. true. I can't imagine my life without him. I love it's you. It's okay. It's okay. Please. No, no. Okay. 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 I feel more. Thank you. Let's have our hands. Thank you. Bye bye. The most handsome man of our time. Boy, boy. Oh, yo. Ah, it's me. Ah, Ngozi. Yes. Good afternoon, sir. Kedu. I'm fine, sir. Ah, I brought vegetable for you to buy. Ah. I don't need vegetable today. Ah, you need vegetable. In fact, vegetable is good for your health. I eat vegetable every day. I eat vegetable morning, afternoon, night. Even in the Bible, Daniel and his Hebrew friends, they preferred vegetable to royal food. You see, at the end of the day, they were more nourished than those that preferred royal food. So you see, vegetable is very good. So you need vegetable. Okay, okay, you've convinced me. Okay. Bring it now. How much are you selling it? Uh, um, it's free. Just take two. Two. Free? Yes. Ah, no. If you are not collecting money, then I don't need it. Mm. One, uh, okay. Um, just take two. Give me 200. 200 naira? Yes. For this vegetable? Yes. It's very cheap. It's cheap, oh? Mm hmm Okay. May I take? Uh -uh. Five hundred. I don't have change, you. you see, just keep the five hundred naira. Let me go to the market. Then when I don't sell, then I'll come back. I'll take the money. Take the five hundred first. Hold it. Hold it. You can keep the change. Are you serious? Yes. I should keep the change. Yes. Hey, one is boom money. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Hmm. 
Comparing Chris with Peter is like comparing life with death. See, Chris is rich, no doubt. But marriage is not all about money. I want to spend the rest of my life with a man I truly love. Peter is not only poor. He is a sickler. He can die any moment. And you think people without health challenges can't die? Yes. People with health challenge are prone to death than normal people. Hmm. Well, I and Peter love each other. And I believe with proper medication, we can live our normal lives. Yes. <sighs> eh, that reminds me. Have you gone for the test? <sighs> Dr. Ekim traveled. And once he's back from the UK, I would go for my test. And after a week, Peter would go for his bone marrow transplant. Babe. Chris loves you so much, and he's willing to do anything for you. He is too authoritative. He can go to hell for all I care. Can his money go to hell for all you care? Hmm? Yes. <laughs> you this girl, you're so funny. And who is messaging? Ooh. Guess what? What is it? Chris just sent 200,000 naira. <sighs> what Peter cannot do? Excuse you. Of course, if he had money, he would do more. I'm no one. He would do more. <laughs> Ah, mommy, fine. Tell me, Fasho. Good morning. Good morning. It has been long. Yes. You travel. For where? I have been around, though. Or hustling and bustling to make ends meet. What did Mango do, Pado? That is good. At the end, we surely meet. He say. <laughs> uh, uh, that reminds me, Mommy, fine. Call that your man to order. Be today. Call him to order. Is anything matter? You know, I am single. And I have been meticulous about finding a wife. Really? That your customer does not want me to settle down. He doesn't want me to marry you. How? You see, the only girl that I love, in fact, the only girl that I love in this whole world, in this whole village, rejected my hand in marriage because of him. Why? I, I, I don't know. Maybe the poor girl is in love with him. And who is the poor girl? Ngozi, of course. Ah, don't worry. If Ngozi Shkuz truly loves you, she will come back to you. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have heard what you said now. I am not even in a, in a, in a hurry. Okay. Eh? I'll wait. I'll wait. Mami yeah. Jama Jama It is good to see you. Thank you very much. Babe, it has been proved beyond every reasonable doubt that love cannot blossom without money. Sorry to disappoint you, girl. I am out to prove you wrong. I bet you it won't last. No, I am not wishing you bad luck. But you will still run back to Chris and ask him to marry you. God forbid. Listen, girl, it's either Peter or Peter. No one in the equation. <laughs> My happiness is your parents will not allow you to drag family reputation into the mud. Becky, wh what in God's name are you even talking about? You're forgetting I'm an adult. And I can make decisions for myself. I know what I want. I know you know what you want. It's okay. It's fine. Let's keep our fingers crossed. Okay? Mm. I will get going now. 
Let me see you. Thanks for coming to see your friend. Thank you. It looks delicious. It is actually. You like it? It's nice. There's still more in the kitchen. Go and get for yourself and your friend. <laughs> no, Mama. I am behind schedule. I'm going to somewhere. Next time. Are you sure you don't want? No, next time. My mom makes the best abacha. The abacha is very delicious. So. <laughs> I can't wait. It's fine. Let me see how. Okay, man. Always time. Is it that she's not seen the money I sent her? How are you acting? Again, she's not taking my calls. What's going on? Could it be the headache? Go worse. Yes, come in. Sit. Have you seen your friend lately? Yes. Thank you so much for the 200k you sent to her. Were you there when I sent the money? Yes. I oh. was with her. So how's she doing? She said she had a mild headache. So what's going on? Hmm. She lied to you. How do you mean? Angel is a master dribbler. She has dribbled you enough. And that is why I am here to set you free. Becky, what exactly are you saying? What are you talking about? Because you need to know the truth and the truth shall set you free. See. What I'm trying to say is that you need to pick the cup, please. Yes, what do you want? Yeah, hello, Chris. Your mom had a fatal accident. Then she was rushed to our hospital. What? How? What? Hello? My mother just had a critical accident. Hi. I am so sorry for that. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Ah, come and join me. I made vegetable soup. Oh, thank you, sir. Ah, sir, you brought good fortune to me today. In fact, I sold everything. How did I bring you good fortune? 
You were the first person to buy from me today. In fact, when I got to the market, I sold everything before any other person. You see? Wow. That's good. <laughs> um, I bought something for you. What is that? It's Opa. Opa? Yes. I don't need it. <laughs> I know you have a city girlfriend, but please accept this from me. It doesn't make you less of a man. Please. Thank you. I should be the one thanking you. Okay, I'll be on my way. Okay. My regards to your mother. Okay. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you, eh? Bye. Bye. <laughs> She has such good manners. Haven't you heard of uh, First Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Go talk.